Greetings everyone and welcome back to our channel. As tax season approaches, it's crucial for businesses to provide W-2 forms to their employees accurately and on time. In today's tutorial, we'll walk you through the step-by-step -step process of generating W-2s for your employees in QuickBooks Online Payroll. This will help you meet your tax obligations efficiently. But before we jump into the action, if you are new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest adventures and it will keep you on the loop for future content. And to our returning viewers, welcome back. We appreciate your ongoing support and cannot wait to embark you on this journey with all of you here on board. Now let's get right into it. Okay, for WTs, there are reasons why uh, importing or generating W-2s in QuickBooks Online Payroll is crucial for both you, the employers, and the employees, right? Obviously, it is a legal requirement in the uh, some countries, like the United States or United Kingdom, for employers to provide W-2 forms to their employees annually, because failing to do so can result in penalties and legal consequences. W-2 form reports employees' annual earnings, you know, tax withholdings, and other essential financial information. And this information is necessary for employees to file their federal and state ta income tax returns accurately. And the timely issuance of W-2 forms ensures that employers are compliant with tax laws and regulations, helping them avoid costly penalties and audits. Because W-2 forms serves as a vital record for employees and they provide a comprehensive summary of an individual's earning and taxes withheld throughout the year, which can be useful for various financial purposes. Providing W-2 forms demonstrates transparency in payroll and tax reporting and building trust between employers and employees. Many government programs such as, you know, Social Security and Medicare rely on accurate income reporting through W-2 forms and to determine eligibility and benefit amounts. Employees use the information on their W-2 forms to file their tax returns, claim deductions, and calculate their tax liability or refund. Timely access to W-2s can expedite the tax filing process. Employers, employees, and tax authorities may need W-2s for auditing, verification, and record-keeping purposes. This will resolve any discrepancies or disputes. So employers in general have a responsibility to provide employees with W-2s that can accurately reflect their earnings and tax withholdings. And this helps ensure that employees fulfill their tax obligations. Now, um, if you are using the same version that I have, your navigation should be looking like this one. So we hover here to, um, it says, Payroll uh, Check Center. When you are in the because if you've watched some of our videos, um, obviously our, our accounts is limited and we only have uh, options to navigate through the, the jungles of a QuickBook. But if you have an existing uh, payroll tax system, when you are in the payroll tax center, you can see on the upper right where it says automated taxes and forms. If it's off, all you got to do is uh, click on, on that. And when you click on that, it will show you the filing resources here on top right where it says W-2s and other stuff like archive forms and QuickBooks compatible tax forms, tax notice, compliance, and forms. Of course, you have to click on W-2s and we'll, we'll, uh, it will lead you through another window where it says employer w-2s now you can you know obviously uh look for the w-2s that you wanted they also offer the w3 summary and just below that is uh the employee w-2s 
you hover down to the W, employee tools, and you can manage or edit the information on that. And one, it will be prompted to another window. And all you gotta do is check all the information. And then, once you are sure, once the forms are ready, you make sure that um, the informations are correct and then if you're ready just print the w2s that easy guys walk in the park and thank you for joining us today if you find this tutorial very helpful please consider liking and subscribing and sharing with others who might benefit and as always if you have any questions or topics you would like us to cover in future videos please let us know in the comments below we love reading your comments and thank you for the continued support it is making our small community grow every day and i'll see you in the next video